Hello, my name is Joel Lababa, and I am the Franchise King. We are going through the Ten Commandments of Franchise Research. You know, the Franchise Research is the most important part of purchasing a franchise. And I'm talking about purchasing the right franchise, because there's no way to find out if you're looking at the right franchise for you unless you do the research. The research will provide the answers, all the answers, if you do it the way that I suggest. Uh, we're going to go with uh, commandment number six. And this, this one is um, it's really important because of the internet. It is this, do not worship false franchise gurus. Here's what's going to happen. You are going to do Google searches and you're going to find franchise opportunities. And then you are going to talk to the franchise salespeople. And remember the last commandment, I said, be nice to the franchise salespeople. And, and I talk about why you need to do that. Uh, but you are going to also run into informational articles about franchising, including how to do franchise research. Here's the thing, not every article provides useful information. Uh, some articles, as a matter of fact, are horrible, horribly written, and they don't really provide a lot of good research tips. You have to be careful about what you read and who to believe. For instance, there are franchise gurus out there who are um, less than honest, let's say. Uh, they are not uh, uh, disclosing some of the relationships they may have with franchisors. For example, last year a, uh, a cheap $9.99 franchise book came out um, that I think is printable, I'm not sure. Anyway, um, it talked about uh, 12 great opportunities to look at, something like that. I'll link to the story below this video so you can see what I mean. Anyway, uh, the author named 12 you know, great opportunities for 2018, uh, something like that. Um, here's the thing. He wrote about each franchise and he provided a little useful, semi-useful information on how to do research, kind of. But he also uh, had the franchisors write descriptions of the franchise opportunities. So you had 12 to choose from. Here's the thing. The reason the book was $9.99 and the reason that he chose 12 different terrific franchisors to discuss in his book was because he was getting paid every time someone bought a franchise from the book. Okay, he set it up so he can track it. Very interesting. He did not disclose that. So, you know, if there's money changing hands, you have to be really, really careful about what you want to believe and what you don't want to believe. Having said that, there are some fantastic franchise experts out there and they write useful information articles and they don't write crap books about you know these are great franchise opportunities and here's why and you know it, it, it's a little tricky um if someone wants to write a book about 12 great franchise opportunities or 10 great franchise franchise opportunities that you should look at or that you should maybe buy i guess it's okay but they need to disclose why they have chosen those franchise opportunities and it usually revolves around money Here's the bottom line. Make sure you vet the people that are writing articles that you find so you can make sure that they really know franchising and there's really no hidden agenda, maybe some hidden links in there where they're going to make some money and, and they don't disclose it because that's not fair. It's not unbiased. Anyway, thank you for watching this video and uh, I will also link to the Ten Commandments of Franchise Research right underneath the article about uh, uh, fake franchise gurus. I am the Franchise King, Joel Ababa. Thanks for watching.